I think we're live. I uh, this looks like we're live. That live. Like we're, oh nope. I, uh, this looks like... <laughs> All right. I think we're live. All right, we're live. Yeah. Should get closer. I think. So I could be on your level. Ooh, my level. Yeah, we got comments. Uh, Rock Zombies in here. What's up, fellas? You're done. RC is in here. What's up, guys? Yeah, we're going. Are What's this on uh, Instagram? Share it. Whoops. Whoops. What'd you do? I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it's possible. I don't think it is what you think it is. Uh, let's see. All or none RC. Happy Thursday. Extreme RC bashers. What's good, guys? Annabelle's in here. What's up, guys? Keep it fun, RC. What's popping? Should be able to get. Keep it fun, Mike. Put it on IG. <laughs> uh, YouTube live control panel. That's not what I want. We already had lunch, Mike. What's <laughs> up, Annabelle? Thanks for tuning in, guys. We just wanted to hop on, talk a little bit. <clears throat> um, I would like to continue these because I think it's it's really cool being in touch with you guys uh, once a week, once every other week, once a month, whatever. Um, so I really just wanted to hop on and talk to you about our latest uh, new VRD stance uh, variable winch mount, which we'll get into that in a second. And then just be here for like questions and, and let you know what we're doing. Um, behind the scenes and all that good stuff. So um, if you have any questions, please drop them in. Um, try to follow up and see. And if you uh, are not subscribed, hopefully you can subscribe. To Hit the that channel. subscribe button. Hit the like button. I don't know what that does, but we don't care. Just do it. <laughs> so uh, old RC Rich is in the house. What up, Rich? What's up, Rich? Um, All right, so my agenda for today. Agenda, damn, all legit. We're just gonna go over the mount, like we said. We're gonna show you the upgrades we did to the new Red Cat Ascent Fusion Carbon. Uh, we did some uh, servo upgrades, wheel and tire upgrades to that truck. I know that just got released yesterday. Um, and we're gonna show you how the mount goes into our stance here and then these will be available soon, so uh, let's get into it. Oh, get into it. Right? Uh, not now. All right, let's get into it. Yeah, I'm it. just still trying to set up technicalities here. It's the first time. First time using YouTube, guys. Amateur hour. To the YouTube. I'm just trying to get this so it should go. Oh, let's show this. Show okay. that. So this is our first design, 3D printed design. This is designed in house by our engineer and. Uh, so we had this kind of design to, and then we mocked it up in here. Came out great. I really loved it. My goal was to be able to use a mount and have it work with all, all our servo winches, no matter which uh, winch from ours you're using. I wanted you to get this mount, be able to drop any winch in it. So not just a certain winch, right? So I'll take this body off. And what's up, Paul's in here? Say hi to Paul. Hey, Paul. Georgia Rock Zombies. Yeah, I understand the time too, guys. It's a weird time, one o'clock, but it works for us. So, <laughs> you know, you guys can watch it later. Um, Check back in. So, this is the VRD winch mount, VRD stance winch mount. On this one, we are, should we use a different camera or? Uh, we can. Like we can go one. like uh, boom. That one. Like that. Yeah. It's our dual cam view, guys. That's right. We're professionals. So here, guys, you can see that we're using the 99 micro winch on that mount, and uh, it kind of leaves space here for like a little battery, or if you want to run your electronics up here, you can do that. Um, 
And then, but if you didn't want to do that and you want to run a full size winch, it does come with these servo ear tabs. Okay, so you can use our, say, what I would prefer out of all the winches is this one, the 300 comp winch, which I would run like this. So I think one of the coolest things to note about this is, is it uses the factory mounting locations. So you don't have to drill any holes. You don't have to modify anything to get this fit. You take out four bolts and our mount will drop right in. And then the nicest part is, is having the offset mounting options allows you to mount a couple different options. And specifically, the internal spools go right in the middle. Like that's going to come right into the middle of your truck, which is, that one's damaged now. <laughs> Who wants the damage one? Scratch and dent sale. So this is how I'm going to run it. So you see, can't get any more middle than that. So yeah, it's perfect. So if you see that drop down, like right in the middle of the truck, it's going to come out right through there exactly where you want it, which is a, it's ideal. Like right there is perfect. As you can see, the 9.9 is mounted pretty much center. So it's a, it's a really ideal mount for this. A lot of thought was taken into it. If you take the 299, you can mount it. I don't know if you guys can see my hand. There it is. I don't know, I'm right. 299, you can mount it in this way, which is a different direction, but it still puts that spool right in the middle. So it gives you several options to be able to get the winch of your desire, whether you want the micro, you want the heavy brass, or you want the speed of the 299. We kind of thought all of that into play when we designed this. Right. So one thing, if you have a 422 inch, our first mass produced servo inch in the market was this one. Still a good workhorse, the beast, it holds a lot of line. So if you have one of these and you want to use that, it'll sit like this. So you won't really get the line won't be in the middle and you can't run it like this because vice versa, same thing. So <clears throat> you already have this on a truck, keep it on the other truck and either get a 299 winch, a 99 winch, or my favorite is the weight, the heavyweight 300 IS brass. Um, so it'll go out right in the middle. And then our 800 IS is the same case. Yeah, 800 IS, same case. It's not available in brass, but... So for you guys that want a lot of power, you could run the 800 in this same low pro internal case setup. That'll put it perfectly in the middle. Right. Let's see here. Uh, You're done, RC. You said the brass micro 99 was a huge upgrade for the Red Cat Ascent 18 from the start. It was my first upgrade on it. I love that. It's, it's a massive upgrade. It was our first upgrade. <laughs> I think uh, so too. Right? Joseph <clears throat> said, what's up, guys? And then Annabelle said, wow, works like a glove. Yeah, it should be awesome drop in, no customization, no modifications, nothing needed. It'll program right into okay. it and, and it'll make it so you guys can run any of these winch options that we provide. You want to say what uh, Josh at Harley was planning on doing? Yeah, so we um, in Scale News Update, if you guys didn't see it, Josh was mentioning if you possibly got the stubby kit. And then you might be able to flip this this way to get a lower center of gravity. So your servo will go from this position to behind the axle. And you might be able to run this like this. Unfortunately, the stubby kits are out of stock. We don't have one. And I don't think they exist anymore. I think it's like a figment of somebody's imagination. I haven't seen a stubby kit in like nine months. Just like it was their figment imagination to call these 475 tires. <laughs> well, that's just because Josh measured them. Like he measures <laughs> other things. Yeah. These are not, not, not 475, 522, 499s. I'm sure Nicole knows all about those measurements of his. Oh, yeah. Six inches. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent okay. gauges in the house. What's up? Hey, Joe. So I wanted to show you guys as close as I can without making it not too blurry how the finish on this uh, mount is unbelievable. I love the matte finish on it uh, with the aluminum. And the ears come off, so you could run it. It'll be like this. I'll just 3D print it, but you get it. So no ears or ears. You could keep the ears and use them for something else. Um, 
but you can see here in the middle it's got the shield cut out for the reefs logo and it's just a really really thought out process to be able to run four different style of winches on one mount which is pretty awesome okay so uh, Adam's in the house. He said, hey, guys, uh, Exo Cage said, this is a nice piece for sure. Rad Raf says, dude, I have a stubby kit. Uh, he's down to test it if we're looking for somebody to help out, and he's local. So oh, we, oh, we, local? We, might, uh, we might have to hit you up, Rad. Well, we are having a comp here on the 30th. Let me know if you want to come down to that. 30th comp. Oh, yeah, Golden, uh, Golden State. State Hobbies? Golden State Comp. Golden State uh, Comp comp here on the, on the 30th. 30th. If you guys want to come, we got tickets on the website. And if you want to come and just play, you just need the website ticket. If you want to come and comp, you got to throw them $10 because I believe it's a cash comp that day. Yeah, I believe you, uh, you have a chance to win a little bit of cash through that cash comp. Yeah, the last time they won, somebody won like three or 400 bucks. So <laughs> That's pretty good. Yeah. Well, if you guys would like to show up and lose to me in a comp, come on through. <laughs> right. Come on through. <laughs> uh let's see scumbag rc says needs one of these for my vrd they are coming out uh they should be available in two weeks two weeks two weeks people be ready yeah save I your nickel like, and dimes like to do the whole pre-order thing i just like the they're out they're out they're out they're out I just obviously they'll be a distributor i was just excited to show you guys so we wanted to get this out to you and show it to you so if you are planning on adding a winch to this truck, this is probably the way to go. So uh, you could run any type of winch on it, basically. And even pushing down all the way, it doesn't, nothing interferes with it. So it's, I really like it. And I really want to see if I do run that servo behind the axle, how would it be if I did flip that upside down and let that servo winch sit really low? Uh, then it would really be even nicer to have this weight down low. So, uh, Scumbag said, perfect. Uh, Brian said, not if I have anything to say about that, Brock. I mean, if you're ready, you're ready. I don't think Ooh, you're ready. Brian? Uh, oh, yeah, Brian? Let's see, Annabelle said, one of these days he'd like to make it out. It's way too far. Uh, you're done, RC. Asked if we were coming to beat the creek. I believe we're going. We'll be there. We'll be, we'll be beating guns the creek. in the backyard. Uh, moonshine. GA Rock Zombies asked this could be adapted to any rig. Anything's possible. I mean, you're not going to be able to drop it in as easy, but if your rig has the same frame rail spacing and you're willing to drill a couple holes and put a mount in, like the front of the VRD, as you can see here, is flat. So anything you'd go into, you'd need like... Oh, you just add a spacer here. Yeah, you need like a 5 mil spacer and to drill a couple holes. Yeah, So it's definitely there. ready to go. So you could probably fit it in like elements and pros and all that i'm curious to see what you guys do with the mount and it's it's for all the machining involved in cutting this block of aluminum down to what you see here the street price is still going to be 39.99 which is a great piece with all the hardware and everything um so we're really excited about it and and i'm really excited to see where you guys if you do you know people put them in the rear and the front whatever like uh upside down and stx pros and elements and red cats all that stuff so it'd be interesting to see because a lot of people want to run this 99 micro winch but they really don't have a spot to put it in but um you could achieve that by this just removing the ears and, I, and i've heard some of our team guys they want to just run their battery right up here and then run this winch so if they're running the battery right here you don't have it on the sides at all. It's going to be cool. So I think running a little 850. Well, 850. You love your 850. I love the little Helios 850s. Those look great. Let's see. Um, Scumbag said Rock Pirates VRD with all the reef goodies. Uh, HT Racing 808. He'd like a direct power low pro servo. That's what he's requesting. He'd really like one of those. Interesting. Okay. Uh, Scott commented, hey, Corey, Brock thinks he can drive. So is Corey GA Rock Zombies? Because I thought that was Scott. Oh. <laughs> and Scott just commenting back and forth to himself. No, Scott. Or Scott's on his own. Corey's on GA Rock. Oh, what's up, Corey and Scott? I mean, I don't think I can drive. We all know we can drive. What's that line from uh, Fast and the Furious? Thinks he can fight. Well, he knows I can fight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I, you know, I, people think I can't drive, but I, I can drive. I, I think I could beat him. No, what? 
I don't. That's wild. This is not living. So we're, we're going to go to uh, beat the creek. Beat it's going to be his first time, and uh, we're going to do the beat the barn. So I'm excited for Brock to try out beat the barn because that's really the only crawling I really do there. And then I do the construction night. The construction night that sounds like fun. So construction stuff. Old Rich needs a VRD winch mount. I guess he's building the VRD kit. You know I got you, Rich. Uh, Henry is HR Racing 808. What's up, Henry? See, I'm bad with names. It's me, Henry. It's me. <laughs> it's not by how you stand by your card. Scott, don't make me make this into Fast and the Furious references all night. I will do it. You don't so just yeah, jump Scott, in the ring with Ollie because you think you can well, box. He well, knows I can box. Well, Scott's going to uh, beat the crease too. He'll be staying with us. All right, Scott. And one night, be, Fast uh, and the Furious. You pick which one. It'll be me, you, Scott, Jeremy Kilburn, and Oren Camp. That's a pretty good group of guys. Yeah. All right, Scott. You pick the Fast and the Furious as long as it's not too Fast and Furious. I can't. I can't do that one. Any other one, I'm in. So, Jer uh, Jeremy, Jeremy Burris. Burris will be a Beat the Creek and yeah. Axial Fest Badlands again. Uh, not us, but we'll have a whole crew there. With the we EV will not out. be at Badlands, but we will have a setup at Badlands, but we personally will not be at Badlands. It's in. He means on. All right, I'm ready. <laughs> I could go for the Brazil one. If it has the rock in it, it's better. Also, I don't want that John Cena one. I'm not watching that one either, Corey. That one's garbage. Oh, Brian took, his <laughs> Brian took his message away. He didn't like it. So, uh, Any questions on the VRD stance, variable winch mount? Anything you guys like to see? Exacto CO cuz. I know uh, Exo Caged has one of these, and so does um, Josh and Matt. Um, so I'm sure they're going to put up a video on it. Uh, Showing you guys how they do it. I don't know if Joe at Exo Cage has that behind the stubby kit or whatever. Um, if he does, I'm sure he'll try to flip it upside down as well. Flip it and reverse um, it. So, yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I don't have that. I've been asking Josh, but they don't have them. But not lucky enough to get it. We're not cool. No. So, yeah, I mean, it would sit like that upside down. Upside down. It's an upside down mount. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Henry Road, Addable, it'll fit my Deluxe 44s better, LOL. I'm using an 800 LP and the BEC, but I hate all the wires. I get that for sure. Um, we may or may not have a solution coming. Let's see. Corey put, how about Halloween Crawl 6? Halloween Crawl. You going to Halloween Halloween Crawl? Mm. He said, mm. all right. I don't know. Thinking said, about it. <laughs> Please bring back some good content, like when you guys almost rolled the UTV. <laughs> that was a good time. Oh, and that was a good Badlands? time in Badlands. Oh, yeah. We're always down for some shenanigans. Real bad decision making when we get together. Yeah, we're not doing Badlands this year though. Go back to the too many events. There it is. Look at that. Now we're big again. Oh yeah. Now we're big again. Uh, next, a limited edition one. A limited edition nine. I mean raw low hundred. Which one? I don't know. Raw. He just said next limited edition, so I threw out a bunch of numbers. Oh, you want a limited edition raw 500. We don't have one of those planned. For what? Just a limited edition. You know, you got the blue one, you got we that the pink, pink one, one, you got we the still have the pink available. We still have pink ones available, yeah. the uh, breast cancer awareness ones. We just release like 20 at a time every so often. So. I know how much you guys love Atlanta. It is Paul, Fallon, Steve. Paul, Steve, what's up, buddy? Yes, LP Direct Power. Animal okay, Annabelle, LP Direct Power is coming, guys. Oh, Sorry, I just, I, dang. I'm hard to keep stuff secret. I just tell everybody. There's only 15 people that are going to know. There's, there's <laughs> only 15 people alive, bro. There's more. This is going to watch by thousands after this. Tell your friends. 900 LP. I've been running it for a month, two months? Yep. A while. It's it's killer, guys. 4S. It is so fast, 4S capable, out of the box. It's a it's a nice time. We're not letting you test anything, Henry. <laughs> we will tell everyone. Steve says, eight hundred LP direct, no scumbag. Nine hundred LP, nine hundred LP. Oh, he corrected. 4S direct. 
4S Direct Power 900 LP. I wish I could go get my rig and show it, but I think there's too many things in that rig that we can't talk about. Can't show so, that rig. Yeah, I can't show <laughs> that rig, guys. Sorry. It's nice. It's real nice. You guys don't mind if I... Screen recorded, posted it. Huh? He wrote, screen reported, posted it. This video isn't going away. It's going to live on YouTube forever. Uh, let's come back. So let's go. I'm excited. I, I was very excited. I mean, to have a 4S low pro direct power is great. Shh, secrets. He said, how do you know? There's more than 15 people here. 15 people what? There's 16. Hey, I, they can know a secret. <laughs> Don't tell your friends. Tell your friends. It's Jeremy in. here. At ease, buddy. It's about time. Top secret. What are you up to, Jeremy, Started today? Started at 1 o'clock. He's only 21 minutes late. Well, we talked about the VRD. Yeah, we're going to hop, in, we're gonna hop into the... Uh, Do you want to talk about the... Uh... Okay, everybody. Boom. Last look. Then there's this new thing. I want to scratch that 300. Boom. All right. So this is the new uh, Ascent Carbon Fusion. Carbon fibers. Or Fusion Carbon. Is it Fusion Carbon or Carbon Fusion? Did you fuse the carbon or did you get the carbon before the fusion? Fusion Carbon. Fusion Carbon. This is Carbon's Fusion Fusion Carbon. Obviously, we're not going to leave the stock servo or stock wheel and tires. So... Nice looking wheel. Um, Trio, baby. This is really cool. I, I really like they stepped up the game a little bit on this. Uh, carbon fiber rails. Uh, a lot, a lot of washers. And what are these called? Standoffs? Or... Yeah. They're uh... two, four, six, eight, nine. It's a lot. They don't want it to have any flex at all. Nine, it is the most rigid. Nine ever. of these. Private you don't need, you don't need that one. You don't need that one. You don't need. You don't need this one. You don't need this one. You don't need that one. You don't need that one. You don't need this one. You, you don't only need, need this one. You, you only need, need this three one. or four of them. But I think so you'll need take two off, of them. Take off four of them. Save all that weight. You don't need all of that. And then uh, we did change the wheels and tires because they're not the ones that come on it are not as good, actually at all. I mean, they're ruptures good. are amazing. Yeah, these are good. Wheels are good. Are these ruptures? Are these yeah. Yeah. Ruptures. Ruptures. I couldn't see. I thought they were ruptures. And trio wheels. Uh, and then we put a 777 and an 800 IS internal winch in ours. Yeah. So let's see here. Jeremy said, I got to pick up a lot of servos that beat the creek. Jeremy, you better hit us up day one if they're the popular servos. That stuff goes quick. Uh, keep it fun said, so pretty. At ease is ordering an Ascent Fusion. Are you ordering an Ascent Fusion or an Ascent Carbon Fusion? Mm. And then <laughs> all the fusions and all the carbons from Rad Raff. Brian wrote Carbons Fibers. My Fusion Ascent is on the way for Jeremy Burris. Animal looks clean, no rock slant. Well, luckily when we crawl inside, everything stays clean. Rocks are clean, trucks clean, you're clean. That's why we have the indoor course. It's Keeps it pretty clean. Yeah, they love red on this truck. I mean, you got the red diff covers, you have the red shock pieces, you have the red servo mount, or the red uh, washers, and we threw our red washers on there too to match the truck. And the little red cap for the wheel. Yeah, I like, I like what they did. I mean... Scott would like a triple seven. Oh yeah, I have to look at one of his. Chris asked if we were coming to Axial Fest. We will be going to Axial Fest West, personally, Axial Fest Badlands, we'll have the team there, but we won't be there. So if you want to see our faces, you got to go to West. Yeah, uh, we'll have the whole booth there. Yeah, the booth there, we'll have the group of guys there. They'll be selling all, Brad, all our products. All the guys will be there selling the products, fully loaded. But um, you, won't get, you won't get this dynamic duo of amazingness. That's not going to be no, there. No, you get the substitution. You get the, uh, the father-son combo. Yeah. <laughs> Steve wrote, that's bullshit. Oh, he's uh, Steve, on. Beat the Creek is Cinco de Mayo weekend. Yeah, we will be there. I sent you the link like two uh, weeks ago. We might fly over the event again this year with our buddy uh, Jeff Hague's plane. He's got the runway in front of the house that we stay at. That sounds terrifying. So we go fly over. I told him don't do barrel rolls. But barrel he'll, rolls? He'll do the barrel rolls. No, roll. I'm going to puke. 
I'm gonna so if you guys are going to beat the creek be there be there let us know scumbag wants a special edition smart 900 or 1100 what do you want to be special about it different color different color better specs smaller bigger you want an orange maybe we'll make an orange one well no i'm making a different one right now uh 1100 a different 1100 what's different about it you blowing that secret today too this kind oh that kind Damn. Yeah. We, we're trying to do these weekly. If you blow all <laughs> the secrets day one. Tell everybody today. Next week, we're just going to be staring at each other. So last week, we uh, released the 900 that wasn't supposed to come out. And we told this other secret. <laughs> and then well, we talked about that other thing. So this week, we're just going to sit here and stare I, at you guys. I think uh, probably like towards the end of the show, we would like you guys to comment what you would like to see next from Reef Cersei. Yeah. Um, um, it could be anything. Could be a new t-shirt. Could be a new hat. Could be that badass duffel bag you want us to bring to a show, even though you can only order it on the website. All the cats are out of the bag. <laughs> uh, this new embroidered hoodie, which is sick, super soft. Uh, the new backpacks on the website. New backpacks are nice. We could, sick. We could technically show them that stuff. Yeah, watch this. I mean, we, we got to get so real. I'm not the IT guy, guys. Our IT guy moved to Indiana. <laughs> Indiana really let me down. Yes, Steve. One see you let me down. Uh, let's catch up on these. Um, Paul said, yeah, Reef's flag. That would be kind of oh, no, cool. He wants the Pirates. Like. Pirates is what Brandon wants. Scumbag wants purple. Um, Henry might be a pro line. It'd be a good time. Oh, nice. All the cats out of the bag. Great live, guys. Great news. Steve said sorry for moving away. So watch this. Let's see if this works. And boom. Look at that. Look at guys. We're on the website and still live. I like that. Have you ever been to this website before? No. I don't think. Is it here? Look at all this. Shirts, hats, hoodies, jackets, bags, tumblers, swag. We haven't Click even talked it. about the new jacket yet. Oh, yeah. Look at the new. Can we make this bigger? Look at the new jacket. Ooh, that new bomber jacket. I don't even have one of these. That's dead. Is it? <laughs> is it cold to beat the creek? Do I need a bomber jacket? Oh, you need a bomber jacket. This is where you put your cigs right here. These are nice bomber jackets. It's probably the nicest jacket I've ever offered. So go know. check out the backpack. Why are you all offer... be rolling in style. Why are you offering extra smalls? Look at the backpack. Bags. Look at that backpack inside. Oh, Look at that. dang! Look at that. All done up. So I hated my current backpack. It's got like 15 pockets. Shoot. This one has three or four. That's Man, perfect. Hike the world. Look at these boots. What are these shoes? Yeah. You can take this backpacking <laughs> across the country. So yeah, there's those. And then there's the duffel bags, which are bananas. There's two colors. Banana. This, this one. I like the dark gray. You like the dark, Does the dark gray come with a girl, though? No. Yeah. Dark gray doesn't come with a girl. <laughs> I think I'm going to get the white one. Look at the dark gray. Super sick. Like inside. The artwork inside. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Getting there. And it's got a little pouch. Turn that's the earth the on the bottom. Yep. Somewhere yeah. we get to the side. No. That's the inside. Oh, that's the inside. Yeah. Sorry, that's too big. I didn't understand it. Well, there it is, guys. There's a website. We haven't even done all the website. We did two things. Oh, snazzy. IT department doing its thing. <laughs> what? Hey, Jeremy, I, uh, I like it. Uh, I showed Shelby my... Uh, Bomber jacket, she immediately made me get her one in medium, so. Dang. I think Heidi needs a small or medium, too. I actually want to get her a small. Guys, look at the amount of hats we have. Yeah, so if you guys haven't checked out the apparel stuff lately, it's, it's we cool. really stepped up our game. We've got everything on demand, printed, and. Everything's ready to go. Hoodies, hat. The hoodies, this is the embroidered hoodie one? that I got on. Uh, no, go down. Mm. The one, no, it's the most expensive one. This one. Yeah, that one. This one. Look at that embroidery. Look at that. That's the back, yeah. Let me update this picture. But I think when you click on it, does it show the whole thing? No? Nope. Just get a glimpse of it. Just a little sneak preview. Don't show Shelby the backpack. Reef knows what happened the last time. She saw something nice at a warehouse. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> Christmas party, maybe? Get Jack. Tell Heidi <laughs> she'll order them. Uh, look at this model. Ooh. Let's see what else we got. We did. Oh, tumblers. You guys seen the tumblers yet? Yep. 
Oh, miss out. All right, I'm getting distracted. All the swag items. Let's go back. Let's go Two dual ones. scram. Oh! Fusion Ascents, Carbons, Fibers, Fibers, Carbons. So, um, so who? Jeremy said he's getting one of these? Jeremy said he's getting one of these. Okay. Uh, so is both Jeremy's, at ease and um, Burris. Whoever You're done RC. those pictures is fired. <laughs> They're stock images. <laughs> uh, uh, she wanted to steal his duffel bag. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, the duffel bag is pretty big. And the, um, so I think it's the size two. of an SCX 6. You can see it. Yeah. Let's here. Let's go back to main screen. Look how big it is. Yeah. It's got a hat on top of it, SCX 6. Yeah. Um, I think when we travel, we all have the same luggage. So it looks. Same. So we look like pretty... even more nerdy than we normally do. Yeah. Speaking of the nerds. Nerds. Speaking of the nerds. To the airport. Uh, Jeremy said his Fusion Carbons, Carbons Fusion shipped today. Oh, so they're already shipping them. Already shipping them. Well, they came out in the magazine the day before they were released. I wonder if that VRD mount could fit in here. Well, what are you going to do with the servo? Oh, yeah. If it was servo and axle, behind yeah, the axle. axle. But they're still running this goofy bent up pan arm mount. It's carbons fine. There's about now. 50 washers on this thing. There's half a million. Yeah. You could save three pounds on the truck if you took off the red washers and the standoffs. It's pretty heavy, though. Well, right? the trio wheels are always pretty heavy. Trio wheels? Yeah, those are thick. And they also have, they have a brass in the front end. I don't know if it's brass or cast, but the front knuckle weights are heavier than what you get on the regular Ascent non-carbons fibers. So tell them about Take that, camel that this doesn't have a big BEC for servos. So just the BEC isn't adjustable. So you can only get, I think it's a six ounce BEC from the factory is what I was told. So you can't, like on the rest of the Fusions, up that BEC. That's why we went direct power for the servo, since we were putting servo in winch. We didn't want that internal BEC to be able to power both of these. So direct power servo, standard servo. Now, yeah, I mean. What's up, guys, from Pegasus Hobbies? Adam's on here. What's up, Adam? Hey, guy. Goat neck crawlers wants that camel hat. It's it's on there. They're available. Head over. I'll give you a discount code. Oh, yeah. We could do one today that says. we. I was. I was <laughs> we could do one. All right, discount code today. What's the discount code? 7.4 fix. We'll see, Jeremy. 7.4. We couldn't figure that out. The thing I read said 6. No, I think it's 6. It's fixed at 7.4. Oh, it's fixed. Okay. Yeah, I got bad info from the intranet. But either way, we wanted most of that power to handle the winch. So we did 777 direct so we don't have to worry about not having as much power as we wanted. So we were going to just do a regular servo, but I decided to go direct power on this one so put it put, put it in the back jeremy said put it put it, the, put it the, the vrd mount is that so you can tow your friends up because i never understood the point of a winch because i i never need one i'm always just up already like so this? oh you want to go dual cam show the dual cam dual cam it up gold jackets for the discount code lol i thought it was secrets revealed <laughs> You can put it back here. Yeah. I mean, you could take the servo ears off and then put it back there and just put a little winch on it in the back in case you need to do a little back winch. Not the back, back winch. winching. I didn't watch their live. I watched another review. Thank you, Jeremy. What's a winch? I don't know. I don't, I just <laughs> crawl up everything. Apparently some guys like them. They need them. It's just the best thing ever. Yeah. It's a bunch of, it's a bunch of weight. They need them to get up there. This thing is like. I Little bricks of gold. If you guys haven't seen six pounds, if you guys haven't seen the brass stuff yet. You gotta, see, you gotta, you gotta see it, feel it, get blinded by it. Blinded by the. But night. now there's fingerprints all over yeah, it. You've been touching all over that thing. Now he's gonna whip me and make me polish it for the next forty-five yeah, minutes. You gotta polish it now, Judah. We need you to polish it. Yeah. Poor so. Judah. Let's go back to this main screen. Oh. So yeah, I think. Uh, what we'll start doing is after the show, um, or maybe during the show, we could do some kind of special or something. Well, you could. So How you do could you do that. You could make it live now. So you could say like, "Hey guys, tonight's special is the cats out of the bag." Type that into our discount code. You'll get 
10% off today, and then you have to be here live to see it because it's only available if you watch it. If someone's dedicated to get 35 minutes into the broadcast, but if you type it, then somebody can just read it. Okay, so let's make Again, one up. Let's make one up. Let's make it somewhat funny. I don't know if Paul's still watching. Secrets Revealed. Paul, are you here? Not Steve Paul. Paul Paul. Secrets Revealed. Hashtag C Secrets Revealed. Mm, I like the cats out of the bag. Hashtag cats out of the bag. Or just cats out of the bag. Cats out of the bag. That's what it is. Hard line Today's, <laughs> today's discount code is cats out of the bag for 10%. 10%. Show up to your live. Well, we got to confirm that Paul's going to do that. I'm, I didn't, I'm on the so, message device uh, nice now. To answer Jeremy Kilburn's question, the, the picture on the website of me wearing the bomber jacket. That's the size large. So Brock would probably wear an XL. Probably, I'd buy an XL. XL. Yeah, cats out of the bag. Jeremy Kilburn wrote it. 10%. No spaces? No spaces. No lowercase. spaces. So yeah, give us about, probably when the show's over, it'll be active. So we're just telling Paul. Paul Wilhite is the Reefs RC brand manager. Paul's got oh, it. He's he here. It. Uh, Cat's out of the bag. Thank you, Paul. So yeah, if you guys are watching um, and you want anything off the website, there you go. Now There's you go get that. Bit, Jer piece. Jeremy can get that uh, camel hat he was looking for earlier. 10% off. Cat's out of the bag. Get Boom. yourself a backpack. XL sold out. Of what? The hoodie? It said the jacket. What? I bought them all. I need a line of them. Oh, oh sold, out. sold out. Dang. You can wear a large, Jeremy. You do not an XL. Not an XL, fella. You, the large is big on me. Look at that picture, how big it is. Look at the, You want to go back to the picture? Yeah. Look at this picture, Jeremy. He's got his pockets in it. He's got a smile. Look at what he frails. Jeremy, Look how trust big it is. me. Grab the large. You'll be happy. It feels so good. Feels so good. Well, let's go back. Nice. Here. One more servo. Nice. There you go, Annabelle. You get a dis little discount today. Scumbag's out here making nice comments. That just doesn't work with his name. Like Scumbag RC. Hey, guys, thanks for all you do for the hobby and helping out our local comp series here in Utah. Who said that? Scumbag RC. That's what I wanted you to reiterate. <laughs> just, it really does not work. We need a new name. Luke, we need to make a nicer, more pleasant. Yeah. How about Nice Guy RC? Nice bags. Nice. <laughs> D-bag RC. I'm nice sorry. Nice bag RC. <laughs> Friendly bag RC. Uh, Thank you, Rad Ref. Yeah, thanks. Appreciate the good comments. Appreciate everybody's support, man, throughout the years. We're only going to get bigger and better as we uh, grow and learn every day. So we're trying to do... Uh, I only try to do cool stuff. So uh, things that I feel like I need or the public needs, but I don't do all kinds of random bullshit. No. Stuff that we want. Stuff that we think is cool. Because we know everybody yeah. else is going to think it's cool. Like this mount. That's why. I, was like, I saw a few mounts out there. I just didn't think they could do what this thing can do. Did you, know? you Did you just do that in your Trump voice? What? Did you just, you're making a Trump impression right no, now? I, I saw two mounts out there. I didn't think they were as good as my mounts. So I, I came out my own mount. I wasn't trying to make a... <laughs> I don't know how to do a Trump impression. <laughs> I thought it was pretty good. It yeah. was better than mine. I saw a lot of mounts out there. I just didn't <laughs> think they were right. My mount's so much better. As a child, I was a troublemaker. My dad called me his scum child. So I went with Scumbag RC. Well, there you go. Now you know the history. Dang, also, he, they're putting on uh, some great events in Utah. North versus South. Yeah. So when are we going to Utah? We're sponsoring that. Maybe. Uh, I swear to God, if you, gotta say, go May, if you say May, I'm going to kill you. We're supposed to be flying overseas in May. Everything's in May, apparently. We're going to Beat the Creek. We're going to Utah. We're going overseas. September, trying to go to Italy for World's Comp. Italy. It's called World's, I think. Right? Is that what it's called? It's called... Uh, it's called something. Hold on. I gave you the name. Wyatt's, is Wyatt watching, too? I know he's going. Uh, let's see. It's no, called no. World's. But anyway, there's a huge crawling thing in Italy by Milan in September. 
that we are going to. Are we um, officially going? I mean, I'm going. Dang. I don't know. Put it on me. Like I might that. send send you guys on DHL Express. D- <laughs> I'll be in my little cocoon up front. <laughs> Dang, like that. It was in September 17th. Yeah, 17th that, that time, right? Let's see. It's called following. I clicked worlds or crawl. Euro crawl. Euro crawl. Euro crawl. That's Euro it. crawl, guys. Look it up. Yeah, Euro crawl. Good job. Um, mm, Triple Seven Brass Edition is sold out. You know what? We might have a couple. We could put one available. Just one? Yeah. yeah it does say sold out. Uh, put me in your duffel bag, Brian says. Put me in the duffel bag. Right. April, March, May, and June. So maybe we'll go back in June. It's going to be hot. I'm kind of fat. I don't know about that. What day is in June? We go in June? We could just make a weekend out of it. It's not like we got to go for the month. Yeah, what day in June? What day in June? We might be able to make it in June. Leave Friday night. After work? Yeah. Work? Um, Get a little Airbnb? Message uh, Ethan. I'll put one triple seven press in stock. Did you message or want me to? Oh, you can do it. Ethan! Just scream it. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, it's not in there. I got it under a different name. Let's just reefs our see or see. Um, so, yeah, it, that's the plan for September. Discount oh, yeah. code COTS out of the bag is live. Dude, look how efficient our guys are. We randomly came up with an idea in the same live. It's ready to go. Perfect. And Judah's already going to throw triple seven brass online. Because Animal's a huge collector. He's got every reef servo. Does That's he have five. every reef servo? Every collection. Every collection edition. He got a triple nine? He does. Dang, he's got a triple nine? He's got a gold raw 500. Gold, those ones were Who got, how did he get a gold? Who sold him a gold? I don't know. <laughs> That's crazy. But a triple nine, there's only 20. I got one of those. Living the dream, traveling to crawl. It is, it is a good time, Go Neck. It's not a, it's not bad. What? Traveling to crawl? No, it's business, guys, all right? Don't get it twisted. I never do anything. <laughs> I'm the life of the party. Yeah. I'm just there to have a good time. I got to be there for business. Someone's there. Yeah, Animal Stokes said he's got the biggest collection. He wrote yes. He told you. I got some stuff Animal doesn't get. Animal, you hit me up. I got some stuff no one's got. Unreleased. That's because we never made it. <laughs> but he has it. <laughs> some, some stuff doesn't go uh, to actual. No, some public. stuff doesn't wake it out. No. We test it, though. Yeah. We do got a bunch, you know, you know the servos that we have. Oh, yeah. The uh, triple seven is in stock. There's Ooh. one in there. One in stock, guys. One in stock. Damn! Look at that. Judah's even on it. Hey, so you guys remember when uh, Red Cat made the Axe Edition? Do you remember? I do. So there was a gray Reef Cersei servo in there, a 422. It's a gray one. Um, I think it's on the shelf still, isn't it? Yeah. I, I, I think I have a whole case of those still. Whole case. Let me know if you guys would like Were those the to have one. Metal tops or plastic tops? Pla- plastic plastic top tops. bottom, but yeah. aluminum. I have one of those in my um, my uh, Tamiya bug. <laughs> you do? Yeah. Okay, so let me know if you guys would want to see those on the website just to get rid of those. 20 that I have, or, or 20 I have left. They're Red Cat. They only came on the RTR rig back in the day. You cannot buy them separately. Uh, and I also, I think I have some of the gold lowrider ones that you can only get with the kit, the, the, the RTR. I don't have those. If um, you guys want, let me know. Jeremy Burris wrote, would two 400 LPs be okay for a Capra four-wheel steer with pro axles? Go 800s. 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 400s more trail. And then Jeremy, other Jeremy, Jeremy to Jeremy's role, bring them to Beat the Creek for sale on site only. The gray ones. The gray ones. That's a good idea. The gray 422s. No so, warranty. So we have how many more minutes? We have minutes. 15 you minutes. Message Ethan, tell him to bring one up. We could show it. The gray and gold. 
But yeah, I think that would be cool because those are what four year old, at least three to four years old. Like, and you can't buy them anymore. This would be a cool thing to throw up there. Whoever, as fast as they sell, then they sell. You know, Ooh. put it on there. Put it on the website. They'll be gone so fast if I only did twenty on the website. Yeah, I, we could bring them to events. Bring five to each event till they're gone. Spread out the love. Yeah. I'm down for low letter gold label. Loose. Make it team only. Look at Henry trying to make it. <laughs> Henry. Henry's not going to make any friends in the chat. Come on, Henry. You yeah, so those are here. cool because people always wanted to buy those, but they couldn't because you could only get them because we were going through the whole deal. They had a deal with Red Cat, so we couldn't sell them on their own, really. So... But now that those cars are really not being made anymore or they're not using them anymore, so we could sell what we have. You. Yeah. I need a gold said. red cat reef. What's up, boys? James Knights. I mean, James is in here. I'll see if we have them, he wrote. Yes, they're in the gray cabinet. <laughs> uh, James is in here, not James Knight. Why not JK? James. Is in here. I got the Axigens and Scalp with the servo still going strong after three years. Goat neck RC crawlers route. That's awesome. Wow. That's, That's pretty, pretty good. good. You should get that out and put like a raw 500 in there. Keep it. It works way better. I think you got to put the whole on the shelf. You got to put the whole truck on the shelf. Yeah, they I have made two runs of those, right? I have one brand new in a box still. I never the got Axigen. Brand oh. new in the box. Is he walking used. up the stairs? Maybe. Let's see. Is he going to open the right door? Does he have them? Oh, he's got the secrets. There yeah, they are. Dude, Thank you. The secrets are revealed. Let's show this camera. Let's go. This oh, camera. we want to go dual? Sorry, my bad. I was reading. Woo! You guys see that? Okay. Well, James, you're going to have to come back and watch it later. Um, so these were, this came out three or four years ago on the gen 8 axe edition and this came on all the low riders the gold one so i think we have like 22 of this maybe 20 of these left um i think separately they were like 70 or 80 dollars for each one so boom you guys want these on the website or yeah you should put those on the website but not these two those, are gonna, those are gonna go with me why well, they're gonna go. The if they're gonna go to the website. I, I gotta know. have them. You see, you can't compete being a collector with him because you don't I already have got them. I don't. Why? No, I didn't own either of these vehicles. You don't have those editions. I have this one inside the uh, bug, but I scratched off the logo, so no one knew what it was. And the gold one. The gold one I never got. I never had a lowrider. I always just use yours. Uh, Brian is really pushing hard for a Pirates Edition eleven hundred, maybe with a bone box that's, logo on it. That's. I mean. We we're, could do that. Down. You we just got to buy 2,000 of them. <laughs> no. Well, Steve has to... Steve has to uh, confirm that. Like, I can't just make it without him. Hit us up, like, Steve. <laughs> message Steve. Tell me he buys 1,000 servos. We'll put a logo on it. It's not 1,000. I'll hook him up. But he just has to get... He has to give me the approval and we could do it. What color would you make? You make it green? Is pirate green? I could make it a different color for him. Mm. We could do Arr. two colors. Two colors on the because same servo or two different colors? You guys notice the 1100 and 900 have two colors. They have gray Good machining. Man. So here on like on the 1100, it's not silver machining. It's dark gray machining. So it's uh, twice. Can you find it on there? Uh, yeah, we can pull it up here. I was just laughing because Annabelle wrote the 777 sold out and I clicked on it. It is already He already gone. bought it. Gone. Up and down, same day. Uh, 1100? Yeah, so if you shoot, show the 1100 up there, you see, if you guys notice the heat sink on that, you see how it's dark gray heat sink? Normally, it's not like that. It's shiny silver, but we did a two-color process on that. So normally, it's like this. That's the normal one, right? So that's why those 1100s and 900s are so pricey, because we did every badass option on there. Hannibal, those are a little more difficult to put live. He's like, put those servos live. Which one? The two red cat ones. Oh, yeah. He's yeah. like, put those servos live. I'm like, ah, that's more difficult. We need a couple minutes. Look at all these. Yeah. 
to a collection. Look at all these. How good is this setup where we can look at the desktop? Wow, you know what I should have done? I should have put our faces here. Oh, yeah. That would have been cool. But, do we do I it mean, live right now? Huh? Do we do it live while we do it right now? Do what? Put our faces there real quick. How do we do that? So that's why I have these. That's why I have you. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Now you should talk about the display stands. This is what you Animal need. has that too. Shh. You put all now the I gotta collection. Go down, now I got to go downstairs and grab one of these. You Thanks, Animal. All, you put all the collection, all your servo collections on there. They're made for stores. I need like nine. But also minutes. they're made for collectors. So you can put all your fancy reef servos on there. Uh, put it on a shelf. Looks pretty cool. But... Also, I think by tonight, I will try to put those, the 20 I have of each, well, minus one and one that he just robbed, but 19, we'll 19. put a few of those on the website tonight, and you could use that code that uh, we talked about, so what was it? Cats out of the bag. Cats out of the bag. Cats out of the bag. Should I pin it? I didn't pin it. You can, right? Yeah, I can pin it. I just, Jeremy wrote it. Can I or pin? Paul, you can pin, oh, pin you Paul's. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, you okay. Well, I had the street price, but that's more important tonight. Boom! Discount code counts. Out of the bag is live. Waiting for it. Dude, Hannibal's just sitting there hitting refresh. I mean, refresh. Refresh. We can just message you to come down here, put these on the website. But all right, we'll put them on. By, we'll put we'll them, put them on. on by by five p.m. before we leave today. But hopefully you guys are all watching, are all subscribers, and tell your friends to subscribe. Tell your if friends, they, tell your mom, have your they, aunt subscribe. If they, if they have Reefs products, they should subscribe because, like, on our first one, I just revealed a lot of our secrets. New servo, so I don't know what next week's gonna hold. Yeah, uh, I'll try. Maybe I won't come on. Maybe I'll have Paul and yeah, you're banned. Paul and you're like a once on. a once a month kind so of. So I don't spill the beans, but they like that I'm on here because they know I spill the beans. I'm the old bad guy. Josh Remick is here. Yeah, I said definitely gonna stop by the next time in town to check out that drift track. Yeah, maybe you can uh, fix my drift car because <laughs> I think it's I broke not the car. <laughs> I think it's I drifted that other one pretty good. This one is drifting ain't easy. Ain't easy. No, how is crawling so much easier than drifting? I love crawling. Crawling so much fun. I got you. I you should see the car first, but I'd appreciate it if you could just put throw a little setup. It's in the shop. It just stays here because I'm so frustrated with it. I can't even bring it home. Yeah. So if we do these weekly, if you'd like to see them weekly, tell us that. If you uh, if you want a better time, tell us that. We just picked one o'clock because it was convenience for us right after lunch. All full. That happened. You know, we're happy. We're not in a bad mood. So um, thought we'd just chat. And I'm sure a lot of people, maybe not a lot of people, a few other people might watch this afterwards. Oh, I'm sure. And thousands. Is that, is that code good afterwards? It'll be on the chat. So they look at this and they watch us. It'll be live. How long do you want to make it live for? 24 hours? Or just sure. today? We can make it 24 hours. Paul, if you're still here, it's going live until 2 o'clock on March 22nd. 2 o'clock, March 22nd. 3.22, 2 p.m. Oh, cool. He shared on the Facebook. Oh, cool. Thank you. Uh, uh, Jeremy Burris wrote, it'd be funny to have a red cap 422 in the carbon ascent. That would be funny. Oh, yeah. It'd probably be better than the stock servo. What are they running there? The stock servo is about 250, right? Torque specs. It just says torque spec. It, it's about 2, 200, 250 around there. This is my pocket. It's got to go in there. But normally, I mean, they only use, it's a step up from the 100 ounce that you yeah. have normally. But. Need a gold plated 299 LP to throw in my drift car. I'm not worried about the weight. We'll sell four of those. Yeah. <laughs> Shiny ass. I think the uh, Red Cat, I mean, I think the Logo Rider guys might buy them. Well, they could, they're using the 800 LP. Yeah. And the Roth Rider. There it is. Roth Yes, Rock. weekly sounds good, Annabelle says. Perfect. Okay. We'll probably make a post next time before we go live to see, like, on Tuesday for any topics or discussion you guys would like to see. We're going to try to keep these right around an hour, um, give out a couple informations, talk about I don't know shit, if we should do, like, time. what Vanquish does, start on Facebook and then hop over here, or can we do both? 
We can do both. We just got to buy that software. Okay. Dang. We're going to have to do some testing if you want that before Thursday because I've never done that before. I, be I got us live on the actual post they made on the first time. I'm like... <laughs> Pat on my back here. Uh, yeah, well, I don't know because maybe people on Facebook yeah. are not on YouTube. I don't know. Just today for all the live people, that's fair. Yep. There it is. So you got to be live. You got to, well, I mean, they got to get 30 minutes into the chat to know that we're even doing this. So they at least got to watch 30 well, minutes. Well, then you can brag your friends. Haha, I watched the live. And oh, we got a subscriber. Woo! <laughs> can you tell who that is? It says Brennan. A little off. Oh, yeah. Does it show up on that other screen? No. Dang, I gotta fix that. I didn't even know it would do that. Yeah, me neither. Uh, Brian says 11 moves, 1100 moves boulders, but can't go wrong with the raw doggity 500 diggity. <laughs> I think that's how you want that. Hey, Brian, are you coming uh, this weekend to help move the rocks around and so we can prep for the comp? Texas salutes you. Good chap. Gotta go. Goat neck RC. Yeah, we're gonna be out of here in four minutes, too. Thank four you for minutes. Joining. We'll see you next week. Hopefully, next week less you'll secrets. have Brock and Paul. No one's going to tune in already next week. They're going to be like, it's no secrets. Brock's not giving anything away. I'll come in and say that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, we are going to Beat the Creek, RC Supremacy. We will be there. We'll be there. It's my first Beat the Creek. Let me know any secrets, anything I need to do. I'm going to bring... Just one rig. Just one rig? I mean, because I, you got to carry probably another one. Because I got to bring like three. <laughs> Chef, um. <laughs> no. These are. Last time I took the Ripper, I'm not shipping. Oof, that. You brought the Ripper? We got two. We should do dual Ripper runs. I don't know. Hey, two Rippers on the Beat the Barn? Two Rippers on. Oh, I'm too scared. That doesn't like over your head? Yeah. I don't want to drop a Ripper. Yeah, no. That sounds terrifying. We could have Jeremy Kilburn bring his Ripper. Dang, Thrace Ripper? And Robert bring his Ripper, and we could have four Rippers. Robert doesn't actually drive, though. Yeah, he has to work. Quattro there. Ripper is no drive. Robert doesn't drive. He looks at cars. Yeah. He's never held a remote. So I hope you guys liked our video showcasing our new VRD stance mount. Any winch you got, you could run it on this. Don't be scared. You could run any winch on it. Uh, available in two weeks, street price $39.99. Jeremy just uh, wrote no. Come on, Jeremy, bring your Ripper. Two Rippers around the Ripper 2 around the corner. I I, is that true? They're going to have to tell me right away because you know I'm going to. I'm going to have to buy one of those. I don't know the real one or the first one. I got four of those. Yeah, I mean, I could get one <laughs> I real four, easily. I got four of those. I got to have at least one of the, the new ones. You should turn on Super Chats to take donos. We uh we thought about that, but we kind of set that up that late in the day. We it's, didn't realize we were going to go live. So we're, we'll, we'll be there in a month. In a month. I guess it's pending for a month. Ask for a prototype to get some reef on it. I don't think we have that kind of pull, Rad Raff. I mean, we're... I mean, I know stuff on it. I just don't... I can't spill their secrets. That would be bad. <laughs> I could only spill my secrets. <laughs> but ship me the rig. I'm only three hours away. <laughs> Who? Jeremy Burst. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Jeremy's always there. I can send him stuff too. Yeah. Jeremy's always everywhere. You gotta put like a ten thousand dollar insurance on that. <laughs> we don't have to ship the ripper. We can just ship like my ship box, and then I can carry the ripper in the backpack. Well, we'll figure it out. Bubble wrap. We'll figure it out. Maybe we'll have a, a little challenge that we'll do at that event or something. Yeah. So, uh, anyway, guys. Thanks for joining. Thank you, guys. We appreciate you supporting Reefs all this uh, all these years. 100%. As we continue to uh, spread into new ventures this year, we, we want you guys to uh, stand behind us and uh, support us as uh, we try to make the baddest shit for you guys. There's a lot so, of cool stuff coming, guys. A lot of amazing stuff. It's going to be a great year. We're excited to be in this hobby. We're excited to support this hobby. Um, without the love for this hobby, we wouldn't do it. So thanks, guys, and uh, we'll see you next week. See you next week, fellas.